Here. Oh, hello, Facebook Live. Hey, Facebook. That's Mike in the back seat. He's the singer of Worm, the world organization. Is it of or for the righteous movement? Of. Of. I always, I always get my prepositions mixed up. And that's Karen. So Mike's got a guitar. Karen's got a bass. Hold this thing up. This is a first. It's the first ukulele in the car. This is extraordinary. Uh, so in a little bit, we're at Village Inn in Skokie, a lovely place, lovely community. Uh, Desi, the owner of Village Inn, is going to be joining us in the car. We'll do a Facebook Live with that. We'll eat his delicious pizza. But first, let's talk about your band. Awesome. Uh, now, when this podcast unloads, when it posts in a couple weeks, uh, the sound will be crystal clear because I've got you both on a microphone. But for now, Mike's in the back seat. He's the lead singer. Uh, so you might, Mike, you might need to lean, lean in just because. Uh, but there give, you us, go. give us some warm history. That's all you, man. Oh, wow. Uh, well, we've been around for about 18 years. Uh, played all over Chicagoland area. Played all over the Midwestern area. Uh, you know, just a little bit of touch of rock and roll, industrial. You know, maybe even a little bit of country here and there, you know. Uh, yeah, I mean, I can't think of much more. I mean... So uh, what, what else could have happened in 18 right, years? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Really, yeah. You know. Well, it was Reedy. Reedy started as an internship at uh, Invisible Records with Martin Atkins mm -hmm. from Pig Face and PIL. Uh, and and Martin Atkins, a former Harcon Carney guest. Awesome, mm -hmm. awesome. Um, he, we were super. Um, it was super awesome. Last year we opened for Pig Face 25th anniversary at yeah. House of Blues, so that was that was a great experience. But um, then there was for a while Reedy Reedy toured with Throw a Kill Cult, which is an old industrial. Yeah, I was stage manager for uh, for uh, the 2006 tour. The first song I played on my 21st birthday was a Daisy Chain for Satan. Beautiful. Nice. Uh -huh. If I would have known that, we would have we would have worked up some sort of I acoustic love, cover I love for you. Kill cult. Groovy's a trip. All right. <laughs> He's a good guy. <laughs> um, so so Worm, uh, the current Worm uh, iteration, I guess, has been going on for for four four years. Yeah. So that's that's when I forcefully joined the band. Um, forcefully, <laughs> you weren't, you weren't going to take no. <laughs> no. I um uh Worm was playing at Reggie's um about four years ago and uh and I had a couple five, six whiskeys in me and uh, I went up to Reedy and I said, Man, I really like your band. Like, there's no bass player on stage. He's like, No, no, I'm like All right, a couple whiskeys, you know, five, six, seven whiskeys. I just basically went up to him and I said, So I've decided that I'm gonna be your bass player. Um here's my number. Um when are we gonna start practicing? And that's pretty much how it went from there. <laughs> who doesn't like who doesn't like a forward woman? I mean, really, exactly. exactly. I mean, <laughs> Got to take charge, right? Exactly. There is no glass ceiling for you, Karen. No, no, <laughs> not at all. <laughs> uh, so, and that's when you re released the album "Early Bird Gets the," which was a delight. The kids oh, love that one. Oh, so good. Yep. Yep. You know, it, on first glance, if someone just stumbled onto maybe your Facebook page, they may think you're a cult. That's fine. Yeah, we're an organization. We yeah, <laughs> we're not a cult. We're an organization. <laughs> but you are a for profit. We're working on changing that. Yeah, yeah. a for a for profit cult. Yeah, you, know, you mentioned uh, industrial, which is absolutely part of your DNA, and you mentioned thrill kill cult. I mean, did you grow up on that stuff? I mean, did you grow up on revolting cocks and KMFDM and Front Two Four Two, all that stuff? Yeah, for them, for I would say for the most part, you know, uh, KMFDM, uh, Skinny Puppy. Um, for me, it was Depeche Mode. Um, I have I have a little. He's got a little bit of country in him, and I got a little bit of rock and roll. So I was I was more Motley Crue, and I think you were more uh, what Chris Christopherson. So <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I grew up with the same stuff. I mean, I was a huge Ministry fan, Nine Inch Nails, Marilyn Manson. Met my wife, and then she introduced me to Pig Face, and that was the rabbit hole. And it just led all the way through everything else after that. Well, now, to be fair, everyone is a member of Pigface. I think I'm a member of Pigface. Probably are. Probably yeah. are. I think we all got a card someplace. <laughs> that, that is a pretty extended. Uh, family there. Yeah. It, it was intense when we played the 25th anniversary to see, um, I think there was 10 drummers on stage um, and seven guitar players. And then it, at one point we all bum rushed. Uh, and so everybody, I, like, I think literally the entire House of Blues, including the audience, was on stage at one point in yeah. time. <laughs> that sounds about right. Yeah. <laughs> all right. So looking ahead for Worm, uh, what's next? What's on the horizon? Shows? Yeah. Music um, studio stuff? Absolutely. So, uh, so in March we released the Unconquerable, uh, which was a self-release title. Um, we've been touring for that, so we've gone, um, we've done Midwest. We are heading down to Tennessee. Uh, we just played a uh, show local. Um, but right now we have. Um, oh, and we we just had a ministry tune uh, that was on a, a ministry compilation. Which um, uh, Deity. Deity. Nice. <laughs> nice. Yeah. Um, and then just lots of shows. Uh, we're working on. Um, 
we're writing a new song for a uh, potential, uh, potential compilation. So I can't really talk, you know, super hush hush on that. Um, and then, and then new album and tour. I mean, that's, that's, that's rock and roll. That's right? the cycle. Right? That's it. That's it. Yeah. Um, I see, Mike looks so cool hanging back there. Like if I were what, if I were watching on Facebook Live right now, I'd want to hang with him. <laughs> well, we all got do. the cowboy hat, the shades. It's you know, it's raining and dark out. I got an extra space right here, you know. Hey, you do. oh, there's always room next to Mike's lap. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, yeah, except being on tour and being stuck in the back seat, we uh, I was, shoulder to shoulder, <laughs> oh, it's a little uncomfortable for you. Well, I, I had to sit bitch in in an SUV when we did this last Wait, run. How so, do you sit bitch in an SUV? I, but, like I, I get it from a motorcycle perspective. Right. Well, I was I was kind of in between, and and oh, okay. I had my guitar player's foot in one direction, and then I had Reedy's head propped up against here. It was. Um, they all said that it was a great tour and it was super comfortable, except. Uh, for me. So. I drool a little bit every once in a while. Who doesn't? Oh, the second I, I, I'm out, I'm, I'm drooling, I'm snoring, <laughs> I'm unbearable, I'm terrible to be around. <laughs> I'm the same way, so. All right, so Worm, thank you so much for meeting up on a Sunday night. Absolutely. In, in the scenic town of Skokie. Uh, we're going to grab Desi from Village Inn. I mentioned that. But before we do that, I, I would hate to see a bass ukulele go to waste. Speaking of ukulele, do you say ukulele? Yes. I was ukulele. Inter I was interviewing Dick Dale, the surf guitar legend a couple years ago Absolutely. who plays ukulele and he he corrected me he said it's ukulele ukulele that's like right facebook ukulele so we have a bass ukulele uh ready to go here we have worm what song are you going to play Acou acoustic this is nuts I, if you're watching this i want you to appreciate what's happening here this is as we d discussed a rock slash industrial this is a much heavier band than typically plays in a mazda 3 right yeah uh so you're going to go do something completely stripped down what are you going to play it's a song called The Devil is a Junkie. The Devil is a Junkie. Yep. Featured on The Unconquerable, which is available on iTunes, Spotify, Google Play, Amazon, uh, CD Baby. So are you the business side of Worm? A little bit. Okay. <laughs> Mike's the artist in the back seat? Yeah. 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 <laughs> okay. I'm getting that. I'm picking up on that. Okay. Uh, so Facebook Live. Uh, we'll be doing this again in a little bit with Village Inn. Uh, Worm is here. Support them. They are local. Uh, definitely support local music and we're gonna have you guys play let me uh, turn down my volume because we don't want my microphone on this and watch this I'm gonna disappear from Facebook live Oh no! because <laughs> no one wants to see me awkwardly bobbing my head to you <laughs> no one needs that so all right we'll, we'll be watching we'll see you that's right okay so Facebook live oh I should mention I'm wearing a white colored shirt today because I decided I can't out goth you, so why even try? Like, I thought about wearing a black t-shirt. I'm like, oh, who the fuck am I kidding? I... <laughs> All right. Worm, here we go. All right.
this world needs me around for someone to blame But I'm immune to the hatred you blow on your sails Living every day in personal hell Take a look around, I am a fantasy That the devil is a junkie and he's got you and me so Something has got a hold of me And it won't let go so Something has got a hold of me And it won't kill them so Something has got a hold of me Yeah! That's Worm, live in a goddamn car. Fuck yeah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was great, guys. Thank you. Thank you. I, I like that breakdown. You just went a cappella there. <laughs> that, that was awesome. That was so cool. Uh, totally Mike, unrehearsed and unplanned. <laughs> Mike in the back seat, Karen in the front seat. Uh, we're going to do this again on Facebook Live tonight, probably within the next 30 minutes. Uh, if you're in the Skokie area, you can hang out on the street and just look through the window uh, where my village and <laughs> people will come if you say that <laughs> they never have I, I keep throwing it out there they never have uh, this live stream brought to you by our friends at Boost Mobile thanks Boost Mobile, thanks, uh, Boost Mobile. and we're going to pause and then we'll, we'll do this again so don't go far from the Facebook you guys are awesome thanks, thanks.